Hello, everyone. This is Karen Cornell, your Creative Memories Advisor. I am going to talk to you about this new 13 by 13 silicone mat that was just part of the adhesive buffet. And um, I didn't sell a lot of them. And I think it's because everybody's like, I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But um, and I didn't buy a ton at first because I wanted to play with it. Well, let me just tell you how much I love it. So um, you know how I had you guys all make these little mats for your repo so that when you like do something, you it doesn't stick to your mat so you don't use your cutting mat. And so we made these out of parchment paper and cardboard. And we love them because they fit right in our bag and all that stuff. Well, that's basically what this is. You can do this and it, no residue. There's nothing. You don't even have to rub anything. It doesn't stick to it. So, um, so you can do this. And the thing I love about this is it's bendable. So if I just need, a, if I only have a little spot on my craft table, like I can have it hang over on the side and just do a little runner. And then I just like fold it and put it off to the side. It rolls up. So it's easy storage. So all you have to do is just roll it like this or you can roll it inside. No, nope, outside. See? I just kind of throw mine everywhere now. I absolutely love it. And it goes like this. And, and, and then you just slide it in your, in your bag to go to a crop. Um, you can wipe it down with like a baby wipe if it gets yucky, but it's, there's nothing to get yucky about. The other neat thing about this is how many of you use the Cricut and you have all these little tiny pieces that you're trying to put together and there's, it never fails. Like some letter or something ends up somewhere and you're like, where's my E? Where's my E? Well, this, the, all the little pieces stick to this without being sticky. So you won't lose all those teeny tiny pieces when you're trying to assemble things because you can assemble it right on this mat because the residue isn't going to stick like your cutting mat would. So, or you don't want to definitely don't want to do it on your cricket mat. So um, this is fantastic. Um, they are, I believe they were $12. Don't quote me on that. Um, I should know that, but I don't because um, it's early. So anyway, um, it's I, um, I did um, secretly order a whole bunch um, right before they sold out. They are sold out. But because um, I was like, I think my ladies are going to want this um, once you see it. But I love that it's bendable, that I can just like use a little bit of it and or all of it, um, you cannot cut on top of this. So do not cut, this is not a cutting mat. This is just kind of like, think of it as like an assembly mat. So, um, but if you still have this, this is great too. This was free, um, but this is very compact and I actually really do love it. <laughs> and I'm not just saying that. Um, I was very apprehensive at first cause I was like, oh, I don't know. I don't know, I don't really need it, but um, yeah. It, it, there's, I mean, you can work on, you know, how to cut at angles. I mean, it's just, there's so many possibilities. I haven't even explored all of them, but these are like the top three of why I love it. So, um, because it's bendable, it, you don't have to clean it. I can use it with repositionable and um, it's compact. So I love it. Um, but this is the 13 by 13 silicone mat and hopefully they'll come out with something like this in the current product line. Um, but I do have some, so if you want one, it's first come, first serve. Thanks.